Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. So today we are here to share with you a paper share that is in. If any of you are familiar with Stampin' Up! products, sometimes Stampin' Up! demonstrators will have a paper share um, where you get several pieces of several different paper collections. Um, so I did the paper share with Janie Backer. Um, she's good friends with my Stampin' Up! demonstrator, Liz, and I've done, um, Janie's the one that I've done the Stampin' Up! bingo and whatnot with her. So here is my paper share. But before we open that, you have to see this cute little card that she made. Um, so it comes in a little box envelope and look at how sweet this is. So I just said, I just wanted to say, and then when you open it, it says, thanks. Isn't that so cute? felt letters look at that wow factor it just sits nicely on the desk like that and then you can write your little note um what she does is she put her note on with like washi a washi um uh, business card if you will and then a little it's a, well it's not washi it's sticky note <laughs> um but here's her information so Janie has her um, group, they do a bunch of project shares and just, you know, they'll all use the same paper collection and then make various um, cards and stuff out of it. So it's super fun. Check her out. She's inspired stamping. Okay, so let's get into, I haven't even opened it. Um, this is the new gold cording. I just ordered this. But you can definitely reuse this cording. She just tied it in a simple bow. You know, it's perfect. Good cording. Always fun when you can use everything. Okay, so here is her. Oh, good. She did. I was worried that there wasn't going to be anything and I didn't know what the stuff was. So, okay, so in the paper share or project share, I should say. Um, what you're going to get is six by six sheets of 56 pieces of various um, paper collections. So you can see the From My Heart, Parisian Blossoms, Peaceful Poppies, Birthday Bonanza, Tropical Oasis, Country Club, and Best Dressed. Um, ribbon, you're going to get 12 different colors, Real Red, Petal Pink, uh, Whisper White, Daffodil Delight, Braided Burlap, Mint Macaroon, uh, Country Club Twine Combo. Sheer Linen, um, Ruched Red, Crinkled Seam Binding, uh, Metallic Edge Ribbon, and Double Stitch um, Satin Ribbon. So that's fun. Embellishments, you get 133 pieces. You're going to get the From My Heart Faceted Gems, Heart Doilies, Champagne Rhinestones, Peaceful Poppy Sequins, Assorted Pom Poms, Tropical Oasis, Trinkets, Best Dressed Tassels, 3x9 Printed Gusseted Cellophane Bags, Peaceful Poppies, Tropical Oasis Memories, and more card pack, and Best Dress 3x3 note cards and envelopes. So I got all of this for, I think it was $40. Um, it was cheaper um, if you're in the same state as her, but y'all know I just moved. So um, she had to mail it to me. So I had to pay for shipping. But even so, 40 bucks was not a big deal. Uh, for all of this. So here is, I think, everything again. Um, yeah, this is everything again in booklet form. So let's see what we have here. I'm just going to kind of keep this booklet, I think. Um, oh, no, this is even better. Okay, so these are the different paper collections, and it tells you what... Um, cardstock goes with these papers. So that's really uh, nice to have because sometimes you look at the colors and you don't know what the colors are to match. And so you can get the solid colors based on this. And these have the um, item numbers so you can order what you like. Okay, so we'll keep that over here to the side and let's open our fun pack. So I'm gonna take out the ribbons and trims first so we can see those. And I just placed an order. I probably should have opened this before I placed the order, but I've just been super busy and basically hoarding all this stuff. So here's the braided burlap. That's super pretty. 
Um, and look at the ends are nice, so you don't have to worry about it fraying. This is the um, Whisper White Crinkled Seam Binding. It's a quarter inch. Uh, we have the Country Club Twine Combo. So it looks like there's like a, um, a red, a blue, a black, and a green. I'm sure that's like terracotta, you know, I don't know. I think that's the only color I know. <laughs> Let me see if it tells you. No, it doesn't tell you the specific colors, but I'm sure it's in here somewhere. Um, okay, so here is the mint macaroon, eighth of an inch. This is gorgeous. I really like this one. This color is so pretty. It's not a not a bright mint, but it's like a vintage mint. I ordered this already, um, petal pink. It is really pretty. It has the gold edge on there. It's a soft baby pink. Um, and then we have real red. Real red is one of my favorite colors. And this is the double stitch ribbon. So you see there's two, it's stitched on the top and the bottom. And then we have the Daffodil Delight, which is another one of my favorite colors. Yeah, it's between um, Daffodil Delight and Crush Curry, which are my two favorite yellows um, that Stampin' Up! offers. They're gorgeous yellows. This is the Rouge, Rouge, I don't know how to say it, um, ribbon. So it has like a little Rouge, you know, edge. And then we have the Metallic Twine. Um, and pattern sequins, I guess they come. It's a celebra This is a celebration item. So if you spend fifty dollars, I think this is one. If you spend fifty dollars, you get this one free. There's a couple of new ones. Like if you spend a hundred dollars for celebration, um, you get like a, there's a punch, and there's dies, and a whole bunch of stuff. So if you, you know, if you really like Stampin' Up products, which I'm sure almost all of us crafters do. Um, celebration is until March and for every $50 you spend you get a free item out of the catalog the celebration catalog and this year they had some really cute stuff I got um, a couple things out of there um, and um, a lot of things off the clearance rack so make sure you check it out if you don't have a Stampin' Up! demonstrator um, I can hook you up with my demonstrator we can hook you up with Janie uh, my demonstrator is Liz we can hook you up with Janie there's a ton of Stampin' Up! demonstrators on my Facebook page, Coffee, Cake, and Crafting. Um, and you can also go to stampinup.com and click on Find a Demonstrator, and you can find a demonstrator near you. So you have multiple ways to get up with a demonstrator. We'll hook you up. And you want to do it now because celebration, you get free stuff. So cool. All right, that's my, my plug. <laughs> um, so this is the From My Heart Faceted Gems. So she gave us a little sample. I th think I bought these they were on my wish list and I can't remember I bought them or not because I really don't use a lot of gems and shaker stuff but they're just so cute and I had to have them so I can't remember if this is one of the items I did buy so you have some like deep pink some baby pink some white absolutely gorgeous and I'm pretty sure she hand sorted all of these <laughs> I just would have been like everyone's getting a quarter teaspoon and that's the end of it um, so we have that. You can definitely reuse that container. Okay, so that's the ribbons and the gems. And then we also have the trinkets and whatnot. So we'll look at the trinkets. Okay, so we have the um, pattern sequins and metallic twine. So this goes with the twine. So there's three different colors of the sequin mix. They have little stripes on there. Super cute. And then we have the Peaceful Poppy Sequins. These were so beautiful. Um, oh, I like this bag where it has the cup measurements. <laughs> Y'all know we love some bags. Okay. The sequin mix, this is like a, a little bit darker because it's supposed to look like a poppy flower. So there's like the reds and the light reds and gold and black and white. It's just a beautiful sequin mix um, that we have here. Let me take some of it out. Okay, so I got my mat. I like to use my old um, cameo mats, the ones that are just, you know, they're they're 
worn out and I just don't restick mine. Um, so, you know, it works perfectly when you're trying to do things like this or when you're looking at glitter because um, it goes on the mat and all over, not all over your workspace. So anyway, so Poppy Parade sequin mix, it has little flowers, it has regular sequins, gold, um, like a peach color, and black. They're super cute. I love the little flower shaped ones and then the regular shaped ones. So there's that. You can see it on the mat here. Um, yeah, so it's just kind of like a catch-all when you use your mats. There's some clear ones in here as well. I don't think I got any clear ones in my hand, but um, yeah, so this is a super cute. I love these colors. Oh my gosh, I just keep pushing them all out. Um, I, I want to say um, this is a coral color. Let me see if it's on here. Light, it's light poppy parade. So there's black, clear, gold, dark poppy parade, and light poppy parade. Well, that answered my question right there. Okay, so next up, let's do the Tropical Oasis and More card pack. This collection is gorgeous. Now remember, this is just a sample, so it's not the whole card pack. This is a pretty big sample. So we got a couple of stickers. So this is a label. A couple of round stickers, some hearts, and it says thanks. Oh yeah, yeah. Sorry guys, my camera. You guys know I have a love-hate relationship with video cameras. This is the newest, latest, greatest. It's guaranteed not to do that. Um, like the autofocus thing. I turned the autofocus off, but um, hmm. anyway. So tropical state of mind. That's really cute. A little pineapple. Oh, they are double-sided. I'll show you the other size in just a second. The flower, rest and relaxation. The best is yet to come in another picture frame. And then here are the backs. Oh, those are gorgeous. That's my favorite so far. That has the palm leaves. Another little frame. The um, graph paper with the edging. A little notepad. Type paper with the flamingos. So cute. This is why I have a hard time with double-sided um, things because I'm always like, oh, I'm going to use both sides. Okay, so that was the Tropical Oasis and more card pack. And then next we have the Best Dressed 3x3 note cards. And yes, they did come with envelopes. Um... Here are the envelopes. They're so cute. Look at these. So this one is polka dots with roses. And this is in the crushed curry. And you can write your little person's name on there or made with love or whatever you want. And this is stripes with polka dots. And then roses with stripes. So super cute. And then the little cards have like a little watercolor on there. So these come as a kit. Um, they are, um, Tropical Oasis Memories and More Card Pack. We just went over that. These were the 3x3 three three cards. I'm trying to find them on the little cheat sheet here. Okay, 3x3 three three Best Dress Note Cards and Envelopes. Um, it's the Daffodil Delight Petal Pink and Purple Posy. So you get a little kit and you have all three of them. It comes with the cards and the envelopes. And then we have the heart doilies. These are gorgeous colors. Look at these. I was going to get the heart punch combo. They have punches as a heart and then a scallop heart. But I already have the regular heart. So I didn't want two regular hearts. Um, because you guys know I got the um, punch holder from Stampin' Storage. And um, it's full. So I don't want to add, you know, I have to take something away to add. So there you go. But these are just absolutely gorgeous. They're pretty thick to be doilies. It is Flirty Flamingo Real Red and White. Okay, and then the Champagne Rhinestone Jewels. I did order these because I thought they were just absolutely gorgeous. My lighting is not going to do these jewels justice, but they are just absolutely beautiful. They are the champagne color. 
Um, I really like these, so I ordered those ones. Okay, so that was in that share. And the share is really nice because sometimes you just don't know, you know, what you want. Some stuff looks horrible in the catalog, but when you get it in real life, it's amazing and vice versa. So when you do the shares, um, you know, you can actually touch and see the, the, the items. Okay, so now we have the assorted pom-poms, the best dressed tassels, and the Tropical Oasis trinkets. Um, so, the best dress tassels come in Petal Pink, Whisper White, and Pretty Peacock are the colors they come in. The pom-poms came with like this, uh, this really cute like little birthday um, set. And it's just, they're just called assorted pom-poms, but they showcased it with this really cute birthday paper and had little animals and stuff on it. It was so super, super cute. So pom-poms, we have Bermuda Bay, Grapefruit Grove, Poppy Parade, and Whisper White. So they're really cute. I wish you guys could see this grapefruit color. It's really pretty, but my lighting's yellow, so you're not going to be able to see it. Okay, and the trinkets, we got a ukulele, a palm tree, um, a hibiscus flower, and a pineapple. Aren't those just too cute for words? So we got that. I am working on using trinkets um, in my projects. I see people use them all the time. It's a super cool way to add a little pizzazz. So... Okay, next we have the 3x9 printed gusseted cellophane bags. I purchased these ones as well because um, they just look super cool and they had like starbursts on them. Uh, that's what I call these. Like They look like dandelions or like a starburst, whatever. So these are really nice for swaps. They're pretty big. You can get a lot of stuff in there. I mean, look at that gusset. It's like a two inch gusset. So you can get a lot of stuff in there uh, for those bags. And then we have the Poppy Parade, or Peaceful Poppies Elements. And so there's some chipboard stickers. Um, okay, let's see. And I don't know if I got the whole kit or not in this because it was open. So um, again, these are just samples. So I don't know if there's more that comes in here or what. So you have the chipboard stickers, you have some um, border strips, banners in a, in a circle, decorated circle, vellum poppies, and other, actually I think they're all poppies, and some leaves. Oh, my camera doesn't like the vellum. Let's see if I can get it up there. And then you have this, which is so cool. This is watercolor paper. Um, and it has, it's been embossed. So you can see the emboss when I put it in the light. So you can use your, um, watercolors, like there's watercolor pencils, there's, you know, watercolor paint, the markers. If you use the watercolor markers, you can use it on there and you spritz it with water and get that cool watercolor effect. So kind of like how these are, these are supposed to look like watercolor. So super fun if you're into you know, messy stuff like that. <laughs> so let's now get into the paper. Okay, so the first one is the Golden Honey Specialty Designer Series paper. This was a celebration product. This is one of the um, free celebration items that I picked because it was so super cute. If you guys follow my hashtag 52 projects, um, Liz did a the shadow box with this paper and it was so super cute and I loved it so I got the paper. Not a huge bee fan because I'm allergic but I mean they're cute to look at I guess. So we'll quickly go through and I'm sorry this video is long I'm rambling because I have to keep pausing the video because as you can hear my phone is going off like crazy and it's important messages I gotta answer so anyway so it's a lot of gold foil black, white, and gold foil, which is absolutely gorgeous. I'm trying to catch it in the light for you guys. This is my favorite, the gold foil honeycomb. 
Oh, that's really cute too. The black honeycomb. This is not foil, this is just black. Next we have the Lily Impressions Designer Series paper. This is a celebration um, paper as well. This one I wasn't sure, um, and I'm glad I didn't buy it because I'm still on the fence with this one. I don't know if I like this paper or not. I mean, it's, it's really cool. Um, it has the succulents. There's a whole new succulent die cuts and stamp set. But um, I'm just really not into um, watercolor or paint um, type stuff, like mixed media. That's the word I was looking for. I'm just really not into mixed media, and this would be amazing with mixed media, I think. But it, it definitely looks like it's canvas. I mean, for someone who's really into mixed media or canvas and painting, I think you would absolutely love this collection. This purple is beautiful. It looks dark on camera, but it is beautiful. Um, I just, it's not my thing. So, so that I don't like it, I just, I don't love it. How about that? I appreciate the art behind it though. And then we have this one with the green. So the next collection is a collection that I, I super love. I bought this collection as well. Um, this is called the Parisian Blossom Specialty Designer Paper, and it has uh, silver foiling. Super pretty. Look at that. This is kind of like the En Francais background stamp, if you guys have that. I use my En Francais stamp a lot. I got it back when it was big old wood mount, and I love it. So this has like the mint macaroon, it has the, I don't know what colors, let me get the cheat sheet here. Um, okay. Golden honey. Birthday bonanza. Okay, I don't see the other one. Peaceful poppies. I think it's petal pink. Bermuda Bay. I don't know. You'll have to look at the. You have to look it up on your own, cause I don't know. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure it's mint macaroon, Bermuda Bay, petal pink, silver. But it is just absolutely beautiful. I love it. It's Paris theme. Stampin' Up has the new Paris dies and the Paris stamp set. I didn't order the dies that are stamp set because I have the Tim Holtz die, which is pretty much the same. Um, and I have a different brand. Um, that has the Eiffel Tower, the Le Fleur, and all the, the same the same stuff that Stampin' Up! had, so I didn't get the stamp set or the dies. Um, this is one of my favorite. It has all the little suitcases with the, um, like the postmarks. And those are really cute. And then lock and key, because, you know, Paris, there's a, a fence that you used to be able to put your lock on so you can lock your love. I think they took it down because it started weighing too much or something. So that was that collection. Next up we have the Tropical Oasis Designer Series Paper. This was another one I was on the fence with. I wanted to touch it before I bought it. Um, this reminds me, if y'all watch Golden Girls or are obsessed with Golden Girls like I am, this is going to remind you of Golden Girls, of Blanche's room, and Sophia's room. Um, yes, I watch Golden Girls that much that I know what the wallpaper looks like. So I was kind of like, I love this paper, but am I really going to use it? I love the flamingos with the um, palm leaves. Here's some hibiscus flowers uh, with some black, or black, with some green texture on the back. The old hatchbacks. This reminds me of like, I feel like this is what, like Dirty Dancing, I feel like this is how they drove up. <laughs> And like some tree trunk and more of the palms, palm trees on the back, and then the fruit. It's really cute. Uh, you know, I've never seen dragon fruit on paper, but this is so cool. I really like this page. And the pineapples on the back. So I might go ahead and order that one too. I don't know. So next is the Peaceful Poppies Designer Series paper. 
and it's very cute it has the purple and the poppies i think red and purple are just a great combination green stripes here's with some berries i have to go quick because i'm trying to keep the video under 30 minutes which i don't think i'm gonna make <laughs> this is such a beautiful beautiful collection um i did not buy it because i'm not really sure what i would make with it but now that i'm looking at it i made by this collection it is just gorgeous. I'm trying not to impulse buy, guys. Just because it looks cool in the catalog. Okay. Next is the Country Club Designer Series Paper. This is a great one for your masculine cards, for Father's Day, um, for your golf enthusiast. Although these are holes in the paper. It's golf balls. <laughs> oh, I love that. These are great, you know, for your dad, your mailman, if he's male. Oh, that's cute. You can watercolor it. You can, you know, use your markers, a little golf cart. Actually, I think I'm going to make um, Valentine for David out of this golf cart because he wants a golf cart <laughs> just to drive around our neighborhood. And yeah, I don't know. Okay. So next is from my heart specialty designers um i did purchase this one because i don't have anything valentine but i purchased it too late i just purchased it yesterday um which valentine's day is like in a week but you know it's still it's just pink and reds not all of it's valentine's day hearts you know um it does have the red foil which is super cool i love these little hearts oh, i love the texture of that like the dots are like raised i like that um, here has some pink, pink foiling, and the keep. Oh, like all the dots are raised. I like that. I'm a texture person. Um, this has the red foiling as well, red and pink foiling, and the keep its arrows or you know any love arrows shot through my heart. You're welcome for those of you who are now singing the song. Um. That one and this is the one I was talking about the pom-poms go with this is just so 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 cute it's the birthday bonanza look at the little toucan it is so cute I love this and then it has like the little starburst on the back or confetti or however you want to call that um, the little koalas so cute with the little funfetti the birthday candles this is how old I just turned <laughs> with a little ice cream scoops. Look at the lions. They are just so cute. So I was, you know, looking at this paper collection, wondering if I can get away with it for like a baby album, but they have party hats on. So you can't really, if it was just the balloons, you could get away with it probably for a baby album, but not with party hats. So it'll just have to be a birthday, like a first birthday album or whatever. Um, yeah. Okay, and last but not least is the Best Dressed Designer Series paper. Uh, this is more watercolor. It's very pretty. Very soft and... Um, okay, it kind of reminds me of my grandma. <laughs> and it has like the lipsticks. Like, again, I'm not a big fan of the watercolor washout and this is kind of the watercolor i mean it's really cute and i'm sure we'll make some great things out of it but it's just not my style the high heel shoes that's really cute i like that oh this is beautiful i really like this paper the polka dots are cute that's super cute just kind of the flowers you know i like flowers and then we have more shoes in color and then we have handbags and stripes. So that is the project share. Um, thanks guys so much for sticking with me and watching. I'm going to make my 30 minutes. Again, if you want to join any of the paper shares, um, contact Janie Backer, Inspired Stamping. She's on um, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram. Um, contact me. I'll get you in contact with her. Again, if you need any Stampin' Up! supplies, Liz can hook you up. Um, and then, like I said, there's several demonstrators on my Facebook page um, that will be happy to hook you up or your local demonstrator. So thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.